course, now all the talk is well, if the unthinkable does happen, yeah. where next? Now, the the clear, obvious, well, the obvious ones that have come through, Manchester City do top the list. They're in every report you read. Manchester United also, as well, from yeah. an English perspective, have popped up from time to time. Inter Milan, here where I'm based, have been very strongly linked before all of this happened as well. And Paris Saint-Germain, of course, whenever a big player becomes available, well, given their spending power, they're always going to be linked as well. Just initially, after the news has broken, how do you feel about some of these reports and rumours and what are you hearing from over there in Barcelona? Yeah, yeah, it sounds... Uh, at the beginning, it was Inter de Milan because you know that uh, uh, in terms of on fiscal finance, uh, Italy is a, is a, a good uh, place to go for, for, yeah, for anyone, but for, the, for football players, uh, mm-hmm. of course. And, and they are saying that Inter de Milan has a lot of money ready for, uh, uh, to offer for Messi, but... Now it's appearing that uh, uh, thing that um, Manchester City is in conversation. Actually, that uh, Messi and his environment is talking with directly with Pep Guardiola again, and they are mm-hmm. offering not only uh, 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 two years or three years in in Manchester, but probably in this in this uh, um, uh, enterprise in the in the company, probably finishing in in New York after mm-hmm. City. So uh, Messi is uh, looking for a project to win. He knows that with Guardiola, it's going to be probably uh, easier. I don't know. We'll see. But but now here in Barcelona, everybody's saying that uh, the city is, as you said, the the first the first one on the list.